Hello, I'm Eric Hanley, an automation specialist with es and &E, and in this video segment, we will review the Rockwell software called Studio 5000 Logix Designer. Before we jump into our content, es and &E offers online training through YouTube. Please like and subscribe to the es and &E TV YouTube channel for how-to applications and other automation content. Logix is the single programming software utilized on Control Logix, Guard Logix, and Compact Logix PAC systems. Unlike all previous generations of Rockwell software, such as RS Logix 5 and RS Logix 500, Studio 5000 is a single programming software that covers all Logix 5000 controllers. Using one software package minimized the learning curve between different hardware and allows for easy reuse of application code across multiple projects. The software features multiple programming editors, such as function block and structured text, that add to the functionality of ladder logic and make it easier to use or implement. The software is more intuitive, plus allows for symbolic naming instead of the structured data model, making it easy to transition from older Rockwell software. The software has added graphical wizards for configuration instead of having dropdowns or limited configuration options. Logix is also a modular style program by utilizing Rockwell and Encompass Partner Developed Add-on Profiles, or AOPs, for hardware configuration. So, you can then search for the device you want to add, for example, a Kinetics servo drive, which will show all the potential options supported by your current controller. Once you find the proper device, you can add it and configure it through the pop-up configuration wizard instead of having to program the individual cards like you had to do with PLC motion cards. After you configure the device, it will also generate all the tags and label them by using an add-on instruction or AOI. An AOI is a snippet of code and corresponding tags that can be used repeatedly. A very simple and common AOI is a timer or TON instruction. The instruction is made up of a preset time for the counter to reach, an accumulated time based on how long it has been active, and a few status bits such as done or timing. Each time that you add a TON instruction, you will always get the same tags and the logic will always execute the same based on those tags and the configuration of the timer. Two other modular programming options are user-defined types, or UDTs, and program tags. UDTs are similar to AOIs but without the code, so you can create your own unique data type which can be made up of multiple other data types, just like the timer. Then, program tags allow you to utilize the same tag name, but reference the program in which it is used to create its own unique memory address. Program tags allow you to copy the code created in the program and simply change the program name to update the specific tags. Using program tags is very similar to AOIs, but AOIs can be called within a program so you can see the logical input and output all within the same code. Within Logic Designer, there is an improved project organizer for better management of the code assets, and network of the project. From the project organizer, you can access trends for live data view, controller tags, program tags, motion axes, and I.O. configuration. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, please contact your local es and &E account manager or automation specialist.